Good morning, it's James, and I do hope and pray this message finds you and your loved ones peaceful, thriving, and well. I want to tell you something. Uh, over New Year's, I set one intention specifically for you, and that was, James, do everything you can the coming year from the Treehouse to share information in such a way that it inspires this community, you, to want to take the most meaningful, fulfilling, and inspired care of yourself because the world needs you. I need you. The world needs you. And we need you to be here bright and brilliant and amazing. And one of the things I'm going to share with you a lot this year is the little things that we can be doing. The little things every single day that have a meaningful difference in how it helps us to be more vital, more compelling in our presence, more courageous in how we show up. And with a level of vitality that literally wakes the world up from its slumber party that we are presently leading right now. My goodness, it's time to wake up. So I'm gonna share with you a little bit about a little bit of movement, okay? This is a little bit about a little bit of movement and what it does in terms of our life expectancy. It's expecting to see our life be extended and meaningfully, at the same time, reducing our risk for many of the diseases that will cause us to leave the planet early and in a way that we miss out on really fulfilling our life's mission. So let's start off with something. This is really interesting. A slow walk, a slow walk. This is really interesting. Five minutes of slow walking. So that is like, oh my goodness, we do that anyway. So just by being intentional, like I'm gonna go for a slow walk for five minutes. I'll see you in five. You're actually gonna bump up your longevity. Like roughly they say somewhere between six months to a year. You know, hey, that's pretty cool, but it shows you as little as five minutes can make a difference. Now, if we were to take that to 20 minutes and become a faster walker, brisk walk, not necessarily like speed walking, like you, on the Olympics, which is unbelievable. Right? You watch them, are like, oh my gosh, look at those hips, my goodness. So it's not bad, but it's a brisk walk where you're kind of getting out there and people can tell you're on a mission. 20 minutes a day will add nearly four years of life expectancy. Whew. That's amazing, right? Four years for just 20 minutes a day. Now, this is interesting. If you were to take that brisk walk and bump it up to a slow jog, which is kind of, it's I, I would think the fast walking would be more meaningful, but this is interesting. So it probably correlates pretty similarly. 20 minutes of slow jogging or any kind of jogging. Listen to this. It actually reduces your risk for premature death by over 40%. So life expectancy is somewhere between 78, 80-ish these days. And you can actually reduce your risk for leaving the planet earlier than that, earlier than that, by 40%. Wow, jogging for 20 minutes. Now, let's say you're just somebody who's going, I, I, I don't have the time. Uh, yeah, I've only, got, I've only got one minute. Well, listen to this. Wow, one minute of running? correlates with seven minutes of more life expectancy. So if we were to run one minute every single day, um, what would that be? That would be roughly getting close to um, somewhere 45 minutes to an hour uh, of life expectancy increase. Now that one, I don't know. <laughs> that one just seems confusing. I'm gonna focus on, for me personally, I'm gonna focus on that two hours of walking. I love walking meditation. I love getting out for at least 20 to 40 minutes every single day in the woods, just walking, taking in the beauty, the cadence, the light, and just getting my heart connected with nature. And look at that, four years of life expectancy increase. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm. Right? So there you go. The intention for all of us, let it be, and let us just absolutely hold this intention right now. I want to be more vital. I want to be a demonstration of possibility. I want to courageously put my self-care at the very front of my to-do list. And I want to do it with zeal and with gratitude and with conviction. It is going to be a non-negotiable because you and I have work to do. We have light to shine. We have love to circulate in a beautiful life to allow to be a demonstration for the rest of the world to see. Thank you. Much love and every blessing. Have an awesome day. Bye for now.